another episode of French. What was it? French. Le Français. The French conquered the world, or all of a good proportion of Africa. So last we left off, we aren't exactly in the same place, and I'll tell you why. Um, you know that thing I usually do in a lot of my games, where I forget to save and... Yeah, um, I forgot to save, but don't worry, we didn't go back too much because I saved yearly. So we actually only went back to 1872, and honestly not that much has changed. And we can actually start annexing Luxembourg right now. That's actually good. We want to make sure Luxembourg's in our city of influence. Anyways, we can stop like the influence on these guys because they're already in our sphere. We can increase our sphere of Luxembourg. Alright, so yeah, that's what's happening. And I didn't, I don't think I did much differently how my colonial setup is, except I did, I am competing with, oh, yeah, Belgium and the two Sicilies, both of my vassals, uh, became great powers, so, yeah, sad day for me. Just, just like, it's a sad day when both of my greatest feared nations just like overshadowed Spain. Like, just, just seriously overshadowed them. So, I'm officially declaring that I don't think Spain's ever going to come back, and I'm just going to sphere them in my nation. And in the war front, with this new kind of alternate timeline, uh, I have now Richmond under my control, and I'm just destroying the South now. Now, I'm taking my rightful revenge against the South. America's starting to actually mobilize its units, and everything's starting to go good. Like, the world feels right right now. Nothing feels like it's out of the ordinary. And I know what this is going to say. We're losing in... What? How are we losing in West Morocco? We were... How? Colonial power. Dang it. Uh, guard post. Hmm. You know, I don't know what happens when you don't add the guard post. Is it like... I don't know. Like, this is my first time ever playing this, and... I'm just so... This is my first time ever using this colonial system. What? Okay, increase that. We have to gain apart these yokels. Yeah, it seems like I'm being competed against, like, everywhere. Um, Swaliland. Let's see, our two main battles are Swaliland. Here. In fact, I'll create a protectorate right here. Because I want to make sure, just in case, somehow, and I don't know how they do this, but if the British do somehow... Uh, do take this part, I'm gonna make sure they gain nothing out of it. They gain no, like, colonial entrances to anywhere else. Um, I'm not sure, by the way, I'm not sure if we'll be able to win these. Cause, it's going to be, yeah, we're gonna fight it, but, I, a sad, this is not good. Yeah, my economic, economically, France has not been good for a while. We've been racking up lots of debt. Um, I've been, oh my goodness, this is, yeah, now we're just, I'm just going to have to deal with the fact that we're not spending anything for a little bit. I'm actually fine with that. Because, you know what, this actually will help us in the long run. Because it actually makes us help us spend more. Uh, militancy. The only problem is that now we got, like, lots of factories. And how much do we own? I think we own a million dollars in debt. And there's a new crisis. Faceland. And I still can't enter it, can I? Yep, I still cannot enter it. And it's for Belgium land, too. I would have so loved to have done this event, too. So sad. So, like, I feel like I'm going to kill someone. That, that just, I don't know. Man. But on the, on the other obvious news, we're having a little bit of a... We're having a little bit of a drift to see who can win the colonies. I don't know who can do it, me or them. And let me see, how much does this pay off of my debt that I've carefully and constructively not paid off this entire... Oh my goodness, we paid off almost all of it in an instant. So, actually we didn't owe that much. That's actually kind of shocking. We didn't owe that much money to most of the world powers. And we paid it off pretty effectively. Um, we're just right now taking over the southern land. Which was the whole reason why we can't join any events. We can't do most things we want to. And it seems like the... Oh my goodness, the Dutch were able to claim back some of the lands. So, wow. And it seems like we have a three-way battle here. We have Western Somalia land, Northern Arcania, Western Morocco. Okay, well, Western Morocco, I'm fighting for, alright? 
that that region's definitely seems Frenchish, so it's definitely getting its fight. Here, I think I'll withdraw. As much as I love this territory, I just don't think I'm going to be able to beat the British here. So I'm just going to withdraw my powers, but I'm going to make sure that all the nearby places already have... Yes, all the nearby places already have me locked into it. Here, though, I don't know why I'm even losing this battle. This should be, like, instantly winning. So, I don't know. This colonial system's a little bit weird to me. Okay, and now we have enough money to repay all of our debts. Okay? And now we can start taxing ourselves that for the money we don't have anymore. Go, go. So spending because apparently we have people... We have social un unemployment now. Yay, who the heck? I I'm seriously... No, I I'm seriously gonna do this. Whoever invented social health care really, really should just... Should just go know that they caused the deaths of millions and millions and millions of government officials. Okay? Okay. Just wanted you to know that. Just wanted you to know whoever out there listens to my channel and has invented social health care. You're the reason why we can't have nice things. Okay. Now, the South... Well, it's now just a gigantic lab, land grab. Now that we've kind of established ourselves. And I think they pulled out. I think, no, no, they did not pull out. So, Western Safaria. Oh, here. Well, the sad part is about this whole entire affair right here, is that even if they do win, and we could create a colony out of West Safaria. Wow, that was really quick. Even if they do, like, win right here, they'll only gain a little bit of colonial exports. And Congo's over here. I know where my Congo land is. Yes! We're officially blocking in the British and their imperialistic people. Because we don't want them to be, you know, taking all this land. And it seems like... The great... What was it? Uh, Portuguese, in the wonderful wisdom, set the empire and gave the Zimbabwe people their freedom. A little bit prematurely, don't you think? You could have probably exploited them for a couple of years before you had to give them back. But, you know, it wasn't like I was gonna ha- Ah! Ah! Okay. I'm gonna stop that voice right now. That's actually kind of killing me. And, wow, we're, for some reason I think we're in an infinite loop where we get infinite money. Cool! Ugh, <laughs> oh, I'm loving this. And we are conquering more and more places. Okay, let's see, Somalia land and West Morocco. Let's see, West Morocco, upgrade, and Somalia land, I already know, get that, and they already got to start on us for, for the next thing. But I am, I'm still trying to figure this out, honestly. Like, I really don't know how this all works. Um, Danzig Nasters have enforced the demand on Puska. Release Danzig. What? Really? Danzig is a... What would you know? Danzig is now an independent country, everyone! <laughs> Clap for them. I mean, they they honestly deserve it. And they're getting kicked by Prescott. What? What? Okay, I haven't been paying time with t attention to base or to, like, negotiations in the past week. And create protectorate. And you see? Voila! I blocked successfully forward. Uh... We really don't want the we really don't want the poor. So annex the CSA. Yes. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, and we can instantly upgrade to a colony, which I guess is just a better version of the fort. And okay, United States has officially ended that, which means we can finally leave. And I'll be like. Adding the, the, what are they called? The Spanish to my sphere of influence. Because I don't think they're ever going to come back. So it'd be a really good idea to have them in there. And now it's time for our other colonial advantages. So colonial map mode. Um, where do we want to go next? We want to go somewhere near, close, and just start like colonizing this entire coast. To make sure that we still have a good like blockade against the British and the Portuguese and all those other nations. And... More Letomps. That's the Letomps, everyone. Just, just so you don't, just so you know. 
That's the Litops. Dang. How did... I don't know how Austria beat me to this region. And apparently I have nationalists. And apparently I'm not gaining any money. So taxes to the extreme. Okay. Like, we're taxing now. And actually, we don't need to be taxing as much, but... Taxes. You can't go wrong with them. And I think I'll keep... My, uh... No, I don't think... I think I'll actually get my army for... Call an ally. Dutch, no. And yes, I know what you're thinking. Why did you just... Why did you just, like... What? Okay, when I backstabbed the, uh, Dutch... Apparently, it, like, dropped me down. Now, I'm not saying anything, but that seems rather peculiar. Okay. Um, split my men. Oh, man. I'm making... I'm making a lot of just diplomatic stupid mistakes right now. It is way too late. and I think the reason why is because it's way too late right now. Okay. I still can't... They only have a... Two how are they beating me? Hmm. Okay, new technology. I think I might have had new technology a while back, but I just kind of ignored it. Hmm. Well, if Austria wants a war, I still have... Right, so the Toms. Ugh, man. Really, I got the deduction that much from not entering on in this war with the Portuguese. I mean... Let's see the war. Oh, come on. I would have to... I just want... For once, I want peace, okay? I don't want to be at war with any other nation for at least a good amount of time. I have not been at peace for a good amount of time. Is that so hard to ask? Seriously. Like, I I'm literally legitly asking. Why can't I have peace? I mean... I, I need to... Rec I need to seriously... Okay, nothing will grow in that region. I know nothing will grow in that region. Don't even try that region. Nothing will grow in that region either. Yeah. But I, I just know that, you know, that should not happen. That should not happen. So, we're still, like, colonizing. And I'm still, like, I'm still enjoying it. Like, the new colonial system is a much more competitive way of conquering Africa. Like, it isn't so much straightforward anymore. It's like, you have to fight. Like, real pioneers to get what you want. And, you know, I kind of... To be honest with you, I kind of like that aspect. And we're losing in Somaliland and West Morocco. Sadly, I can't do anything because I don't have any more colonial power. And that's because I'm investing a lot. So, you know what? How much is this region? Okay. I'll withdraw. But I'm instantly sending some settlers over here. Okay, I already have some settlers over there because... I don't think I'm going to win that. I'm I'm just, at this point, I think I'm just fooling myself. Uh, any other place so I can, like, start colonializing. Colonializing. Colonizing. <sighs> Words escape me. Okay, but that's, that's my new region. So, it seems like another, we had to lose. We had to gain some, of, or give up some of our land. But we already have a good leap on the Austrians and over here. So I doubt they're going to be able to, like, outproduce us here. And I almost have this entire region, like, sectored off so they won't be able to, like, you know, go in and steal all this or do anything. And the Ottomans don't seem to be, like, investing that much into it. And I'm kind of glad. And, woo, we have a new... Ooh, ooh, ooh. So, Inner Manchuka has been declared a colony, so I think this is it. Yep! And we officially just, like, blocked them from ever becoming a colony. And Lindai... Where's Lindai? Hmm. Huh. Where is Lindai? Lindai. Oh dang. Oh come on, no. No. Okay, we cannot let the... Uh, how... How did they... Uh, see, I don't understand this. How they even like... Uh... Lindai. Okay, let's see if the search... Please tell me the search engine actually has a region called Lindai. Lin... Lindai! 
Oh, this region. Okay, create protectorate. Okay. Can I invest in this? Ah! Okay, well, I'm going to instantly cut these guys off. So let me see regions so that we don't have to, like... I already have this region under control. But well, mostly... I just need to like, cut off this region right here. Yeah, I just need to seal up that little pocket of resistance. And I should be good. What? I didn't colonize over there. Okay. Acceptance is the first way to a new government. What? What are you saying anymore? I really don't know, people. At this point, I should really stop playing the game, but I am so entranced with like this new colonization pre like colonization thing. And Lindai again! Lindai, you are now a state. Congratulations. Whole colony, congratulations. With that, you deserve special privileges like you will be oppressed and we will take all your land. And I'm actually gaining money now, which is actually pretty dang awesome. Without me going to war and having to extensively fight right now, it's just, this is just kind of a growing French period, where we just kind of relax and take in all the new and the old, sadly. You, you have to have the old, it's just, it's just what the old is for. But, also, if anyone's worried about that, like, prestige drop thing, I'll probably be able to get that up in a couple, like, weeks or so. Because I'm going to have the Panama Canal built. I'm going to invest in more like luxurious. Um, probably bankrupting uh, things. So you know, don't worry. I'll still have that done. And how are we doing in price? You know we can actually low. No. That's good. Okay. That is good for what we need. Naval 10 days. Okay. So now we just need to figure out. Or, I need to figure out which one's nitroglycerin. Okay, we need to start research on that so we can start getting the colonies again. I mean, the Su the Suez and the Panama Canal. Because that's the whole reason why we conquered Colombia. And, you know, I want to make good on that promise of killing Colombia. Colombians must... No, look. That's not what I mean. I'm so, like, brain dead right now. But I want to finish this. Or at least I want to keep playing... Okay, what's next? Tongo! Okay, word search Tongo. And sorry that I don't know any of these. Tongo. Tongo. Togo. Okay, no one knows, no one knows where that is. So that means I'm just going to have to find it. Okay, colonial map mode. Uh, let's see, what regions are we working on so I can kind of... Oh, there it is. Yes! Okay. And it seems like none of the uh, other world powers are trying to colonize this region. I'm guessing Tongo can become a state yet. I Then I'm going to try to, like... What's the best... Okay, if I just gain this right here. Dang. Okay. When I have the power, I'm going to start producing states right there. Uh, I think I can now almost influence the Spanish invasion, or Spanish even more. Wait, no, that's not Spanish? Who am I trying to influence? The Papel States? Oh yeah, because they got out of our sphere of influence because of... Rebels. Well, now they're back in. Yay! We admitted them back into our sphere. And Labor Crisis... Uh, let's do Militancy. Because right now the Militancy is actually going up pretty high. And what is the main... Region, low pensions, minimum wage, low subsidies, basic school system. Hmm. Basic school system I like. Because basic school system actually like helps us out in the long run. So, basic school system it is. And we officially pulled out the United States. The United States should be coming like a big gigantic powerhouse here. With industry, marketing, and everything. Because now that they are officially united... Well, actually, not completely united. They still need to take this little Oregon state over here, which I'm still waiting for them to do. And now we are gaining... We have now gained Spain under our sphere! Yay! And I hope Luxembourg, too? Luxembourg, will you, will you join us? No. Seems like we still have to fight our way up. And it seems like we're losing in Kenya. 
Where the heck is... Okay. Pause it. Where the heck is Kenya? Okay. Alright. Figures. So I probably won't win in that place. But the good thing is, is I can probably distract them enough to where... I can probably cross-colonialize. If that's even a word. To make sure that they do not go any further than what they already have. Which is good. Because they don't deserve it. This is my land. Not yours. And... Yeah. Okay, right here. Ah, uh, dang, we need Colonial 8. Dang, I have like... I'm so close to like Colonial 70. Maybe just wait one month and I should have it. Internal Crisis! Oh! And... Oh, 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 oh. Okay, this is gonna have to be an episode. This was a pretty long episode. And I'll see you guys. And... I'm gonna have to take a break, but we finally have an event I've been looking forward to for a very long time, which is the independence of Poland. Oh my goodness, if we can pull this off, we can potentially damage the the Russian Empire and start imposing our own demands. So, but for now, I need a break, um, and I'll see you guys next time.